Okay, hey guys, today we're checking out Rose Gourmand from Zara. Oh, look at that, a pretty cool reflection of me in a model. <laughs> I like it. So it's uh, Eau de Parfum Concentration. Bottle is really cool, nice and fancy, very classy, I like it. Very hefty. Cap slides snugly into place. Very good. And the atomizer. It's okay. So, oh my god. Whew, yeah, it's good, it's good. A lot of uh, people comparing this one to Mansara Roses Vanille. And I do agree with them. It has some similarities, but also has some slight differences. I tested Mansara Roses Vanille yesterday my local retailer and what I can say Mansara opens up with the citrus it has the citrus splash you know kind of dissipates fast but still this one however has the fresh rose in the opening as the fragrance develops you get that creamy jammy vanillic mostly I'd say creamy jammy kind of rolls, which is transition to the vanilla side. Uh, it also has a tonka in a base, but I don't smell that powderness from the tonka. I don't get it. Maybe it plays its part as a supporting note, but it's more on a roses, uh, creamy jammy roses and vanilla in a base. Pretty straightforward fragrance, very, very simple and yet very sexy, very intimate and delivering. What uh, does it differenti differentiate it, this one from Mansara the most for me is that Mansara has the mask in a base. You kind of feel it um, as the fragrance develops. Here it's more on a sweet vanilla side with the hints of that jammy rose. That's what you get. Uh, so yeah, I wore it and uh, projection not so strong it was about 40 minutes. Actually, I guess it depends how much you spray. Uh, longevity up to four hours. So yeah, it's pretty good for. I, don't, I know Zara fragrances. Yeah, some of them are good, but uh, they doesn't last long. Uh, this one is no exception. But however, it's very, very good fragrance the, for the people who like rose on the sweeter side. Still synthetic a little bit, but yet amazing. Perfect for date nights, and you now it has some, has some, you know, some special about it. I don't know, something special about it. Uh, what else? I guess this is it. So, um, of the start, fresh rose, which is transition to the sweet gourmand, uh, candied rose, and then as the fragrance develops, in a base you get nice creamy vanilla with the hints of rose. What I like the most, it doesn't have that powderness, you know. Very slight, very mild, amazing stuff. So um, I think if, if it has the powderness, it would be very off-putting, but this one doesn't, and thankfully it's very... This is a good, this is a good one. So for the ladies who, are, who likes roses on that gourmand, sweet, vanilla side. Yeah, it's amazing stuff, amazing alternative from Mansara. Although, yeah, it has some differences, as I said, but DNA, actually the same. So yeah, that's basically it. Thank you for your time and see you soon.